What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Thanks for pressing play. My name is Justin and today we're going to talk about the C8 Corvette Z06. The fact that we're about to get some more allocations for this thing this month and the fact that a lot of these cars are being delivered as we speak. Let's jump right into it. All right, guys, so just like you heard there in the beginning, the C8 Corvette Z06 is coming, and some people are already getting delivered these things. It's fantastic. It's finally happening. Thank God, because all of us are just chomping at the bit for this car. I know it. But we are over at the midenginecorvetteforum.com, and sure enough, don't we get some more confirmed information about some other Z06s being delivered and some hitting 3400 status that will be built later this month, as well as a schedule for when we're going to get Get some more allocations for the C8 Corvette Z06. So if you're waiting for this car, this is something you're going to want to hear. So over on the forum, we get some information coming to us from Matt Beaver. Now, for those of you who don't know who Matt Beaver is, he is actually a salesman over at Whitmoyer, which is right here in the good old state of Pennsylvania. And obviously he's going to know about this stuff because he is able to see it in the computer system. With all of that said, it's not super easy to see this stuff in the system. Apparently some of the people over at the mid engine Corvette forum com talk about the fact that it takes a while to compile a list like this so anybody who wants to go give matt beaver a thanks go ahead and check him out on instagram and give him a big thanks for all of us in the corvette community because this is an awesome list now the thing you're seeing here on the screen is actually showing all of the c8 corvette z06s in the system the shaded ones have already been built the white ones are in 3400 status and about to be built now that's not the end of the information today guys we also are going to talk a little bit more about the allocations coming later this month. So if you're on the list for getting a Z06, but you never got an allocation, guess what? You still have a chance of getting one this year, but we'll talk about that in one second. I want to go over some of the dealerships that have already gotten the C8 Corvette Z06. The big name on the list here, of course, we can see is Sioka Chevrolet. They actually have a bunch of them sitting right out front waiting for their faithful buyers to come pick them up. And the managing Corvette forum has already gone over some of these. They've talked about how five of them have been delivered, but it actually looks like they have gotten six. So as you can see, the grayed out ones are already delivered and there are six listed there for Sioka. Now it is possible one of them already was picked up or one of them was sitting somewhere outside of the view of the camera, but most of the pictures grabbed five of these things being delivered. With that said, there are a couple other dealerships on here that stand out. Obviously Rick Hendrick has a couple delivered on there. And the big one that stands out to me is Bombin Chevrolet. That's actually the dealership where I first got to see the Z07 package Z06. I went down there with my friend Jason from Front Seat Driver and we checked out the car from head to toe. That is a really awesome dealership. I really enjoyed the experience and they managed to get at least one of them and that's pretty cool. But anyway, moving on to the ones that haven't been delivered yet, we got three more Siokas in there. So Sioka Chevrolet is obviously a pretty big dealership for Corvettes. They're getting at least three more of them here very soon and these are not even counting in the allocations for or later on in November yet either. So if your dealership is on this list and you're number one at your dealership, congratulations, because that's probably your car sitting there. And in case you were saying, well, Justin, that list doesn't look that big. Yeah, all we had to do is scroll down a little bit and here is a bunch more waiting to be built. Yeah. So again, guys, this list is put together by Matt Beaver and he works over at the Whitmoyer Chevrolet dealership. His dealership is listed on here three times and that's awesome that he would go through the effort of putting this together for us Corvette people. So again, please go say thank you to him for that. As you can see though, this second list is much larger. There are still a good bit of completed builds, but a lot more below that are not complete. And these will be completed shortly because they are at at least 3000 status. So these cars will be built within the next month or so at the latest. And again, these are still not the November allocations of which none of us even knew anything about until a few days ago. So GM decided to drop us a little carrot and say, hey, here's a couple more allocations for this thing. But like I said, guys, that is not even the most exciting information here. And that is going to be the fact that the Z06 estimated shipments in cycle two of each month are going to start with November cycle two on 1116. So in 10 days, we're going to get some more shipments of these things. But we have some more information. Again, thanks to our friends over at the mid engine Corvette John over there says that there are two upcoming key dates 
Thursday, November 10th, dealers are given the number of Z06 allocations they can officially enter this round. So on November 10th, you should have an idea if you're getting an allocation or not. Thursday, November 17th, dealers may start to enter that number of Z06 orders into the receipt process. Between that Thursday and the end of the following day, dealers need to enter their Z06 orders. Please note, as is the GM standard process, constraints will be shared on either Wednesday the 16th or Thursday the 17th. So again, in about 10 days, Days, we're going to know if you're going to get an allocation, what the constraints are going to be, if any, hopefully none, but that's a big hopefully. And you're actually going to be able to start putting your order in on the following day, the 17th. And of course, John goes on to talk about how excited he is that he's talking about this now instead of after the new year, like we were originally told. So like I said, GM's giving us a little bit of a dangling carrot, letting us know we're going to get at least a couple more allocations before the actual calendar year of 2023. That's really cool. But at the same time, they don't tell us how many more could be three could be 300 let's hope for the latter he does go on to say that at the end here that this was independently confirmed by the above gm document and please note when reading this one that the words quote unquote shipments actually means quote unquote allocations i personally verified that with the chief corvette specialist dave salvatore but he is not the one that provided this document this is just something that was clarified earlier on so either way guys all good information all the way around the allocations are coming the Shipments are going out. People are getting these cars finally. The car is no longer a pipe dream for some people. This thing is actually happening. Hopefully, you are one of them that gets one of these cars. But anyway, guys, that's going to do it for today's video. So if you liked what you saw, hit that thumbs up button. Let me know you like the content so we can keep making this stuff for you. If you have any questions about the content, leave them in the comment section down below, and I'll be glad to answer anything you may have. If you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, please do. I'm going to have loads of content like this coming you're not going to want to miss. And as always, guys, I will catch you in in the next upload.